After packing, I spent the day reminiscing. This is where I got recognized on the street for the first time. A group of high schoolers were doing a bake sale. A few of them were in those animal costumes, even on the hot ass LA day. And they had this cheery, chirpy energy that made me giggle like I was a part of their crew, their club. And then I went to buy two cookies to support and one of the girls recognized me through my comics. I, luckily, I even had a zine on me, so I was able to gift it to her. She was so sweet. They were also lovely. This is one of the locations where my zines are sold. A real physical bookstore in the physical realm. And I would walk in here or a good used bookstore or a skylight or North Fig and walk in and there I am. I would pinch myself every time. This is where I sold my first painting ever. I was working as a barista in 2020, finding my way to my dream job. But I did truly enjoy my time here. It taught me so much and I loved my regulars. I doodled on their cups and that would make them smile. I gave stickers to kids. This was also where the earliest versions of my Clown Life Izzy character can be traced back to. I was just messing around and it also showed me what can come out of a state of pure play and dicking around. My boss Paul liked my paintings and told me I should do a couple to hang up at the cafe. I made four pieces. And every single one of them sold. That gave me this confidence, something that I wouldn't have believed until it happened. When you go visit today, there is still this tear left behind in the wallpaper from my command strip. Sorry, Paul. Everyone go visit Ideology Coffee Glendale and buy all their drinks. They're great people doing honest business. And I get the Lox Bagel on an everything bagel with an Arnold Palmer and Berry Hibiscus. Tell them that Izzy sent you and that she says, sorry about the wallpaper, Paul. And thank you for appreciating me. My film production company, Poppy Hat Studios, has a space in downtown LA. I'm keeping it as home base and for when we shoot quarterly. But while I'm abroad, I organized a few trusted artists to maintain and use the space for resources, like a residency for their own art practices. At this point, I've been prepping it for weeks, months, to have it as a smooth handoff. Somehow, even after tens of hours of prepping and purging, here I still was. What the fuck? 12 hours before my flight, laying on the concrete floor in an avalanche of odd props and old sketchbooks, seriously doubting if this can ever be done. And then I made a very, very, very big mistake. While archiving sketchbooks, old ones, I read my journal entries from right before my big breakup. Very big mistake. 
I bailed on the cool party I was supposed to go to as a last huzzah, and I, I sobbed and sobbed and sobbed on that floor. I texted my friend here. Hey girl, I really wanted to make it to the party and see you one last time, but this is me right now packing up my archive, and I made the mistake of reading my journals from when I was about to break up with my ex. Oopsie! and give you a guide of the updated Poppy Hot Studios prepared for your residency. Ah! Okay, we start at the door. The key, just in case. <gasps> now when we walk in, ooh, ah. For this, I'm gonna take this with me to Amsterdam. First and foremost, 0.5, or actual meaning for 0.5, not just for like this. The archive, sticky hair gallery stuff, older stuff, even like sketchbooks from 2013. If you ever want to mop, the mop is under the trash. So if you do want to mop, you're going to have to take out the trash first. And if you don't want to do that, you probably don't really need a mop. <laughs> don't touch them. Leave your coats. This is actually fully installed now. Hee <laughs> hee. So I put all the snackies here. These are all your designated square. These bins, each of these um, actually is supposed to stack the vis again. But after like the last three months I had, this bitch almost broke me. Like this could have been my 13th reason and it damn well was my 12th and a half. So, see? You, you see what it's doing to me? <laughs> your keys are also here on the corner of your folders. A little balloon animal kit, just a little nudge of encouragement of pursuing the craft. Hee <laughs> hee, more kiss you on your forehead. Okay. Fuck, okay. Um, okay, now here. I'm gonna set up that computer station next time I'm here. Scanner. Feel free to use it. Uh, you can get your medicine if you need, your other kind of medicine if you prefer that one. Here's your little resting area. Oh, hey, that's me. Hello. We have a little, we have the, actually the proper residence. Say hello. Hi. Actually, um, this one's name is Shush. I got it in a arcade like crane machine in Korea. This is my story. My name is Shush. It begins here. It's been 1800, 205. Sorry, I'm not good at counting. It's been a lot of days, but then finally I became free. Thanks to this gorgeous creature, I decided to call her Bow. Short for Balloon. It was not pleasant being held by the brain like this, but I let it happen. This Bow saved my life. Oh, brought me to this place? You seem kind of sad. I think she grew up here. I was visiting one last time, which yeah, I guess is kind of sad. But sorry, can't relate. I couldn't wait to get out of that shithole. I was surrounded by idiots who kept pooping their pants. What pants? You don't understand the sheep and down. Mm -hmm. Well, in this moment, I did also poop my pants. <laughs> that's but that's the Bo took me to this area that was a lot bigger than the other place. Oh, and then right here, right here. This is when she kept crying. She was like, Wah, I'm gonna miss you. Wah, when I'm gonna see you next. Which, once again, sorry, can't relate. I couldn't wait to get the fuck out of there. Never see those bitches again. Well, I don't know where we're going, but I'm just very excited. Seems like Bo snacks a lot. <laughs> seems like Bo snacks a lot. We finally landed, and it seems like it's so much warmer here. I'm gonna need a haircut for my fleas. I mean, this place is kind of small. I'm sure Bo's got her own place, so this place is just fine. This is my friend Wow. Say hello to Wow. I'm excited, you know? Like, I'm still learning how to live life. Pretty new to this outside of the claw. So I decided to learn by doing what Bo does. And from my observation, Bo just leaves here and watches the square metal thing for hours. So I decided to do the same. Wow, life is great. And Shush is Korean, so you're gonna have to learn Korean to speak to Shush. Nyaseyo. <laughs> Oh, I saw, saw, saw. I have two workstations. Do not worry uh, if they fall. It's a speaker. So if you're doing sewing projects, which by the way, the sewing machine is out of operation right now. There was a little drama, but um, ignore I said that. Never mind. Whatever, whatever. <laughs> Someone broke it. Uh, it's not one of you guys. <laughs> it's the okay. I'm not gonna. I'll tell you later. I'll tell you later when I'm off the camera. Anything that's in these drawers, please, please, please feel free to use. Like anything here, all these Polaroid films and this iType camera, there's little lenses. Please feel free to use these. I'm very excited for this. We have a wardrobe situation going on. Uh, and on top of that, actually, I have some of my paintings up and I have our official poppy hat. Photo that my friend Lizzie took of me and made that crayon frame. And I feel very Magneto <laughs> with this setup. And I'm very happy about it. These are here so that you guys can use it. A lot of these clips, I got them from my friend um, Ruby. That's her prom dress. Like, girl, you're crazy. That's beautiful. That's her prom dress. There's like a wedding dress from her old landlord. Like, there's super crazy pieces in here that all look beautiful in shoots. My next new favorite thing. <laughs> I, got, I was checking out to get this at Ikea. And the checkout lady is like, oh, how old's your little? <laughs> and I'm like... 
for. What I realized that I really should have had this whole time for myself is a resting spot, because that couch is pretty, but it's not very comfy. But this, this little thing. So you enter our right, and there's pillows, and there's all these blankies that I set up, uh, and there's this big pillow, and you can just be like nappy time here. And it's so cozy. And yeah, like half your body sticking out. But I swear to God, if you also like, if you have like a little bit of tism, like this is like heaven in the bottle, dude. Like, and also like when you look up here, you can see me. Haha, <laughs> look, it's me. Hi, what's up, girl? Uh, but it's just a really nice resting spot. And I, uh, that's one thing that I would want to leave on is like, girl, take your breaks. <laughs> literally at myself girl take your breaks and like even just having this today is kind of life-changing bro like i did a lot of emotional processing here dude like it was super emotional day today <laughs> i don't know if you would have guessed but like it was kind of like really emotional <laughs> and then i just like would have my like my quiet here and like my <sighs> what the fuck here and like just being in this canopy Literally, I could just fall asleep here. Okay, rest of the tour. Let's go. Let's go, bitch. Blah. Okay. <sighs> rest is pretty self-explanatory. For, like, your whole team to be able to, like, show them, like, this is our shoot today. What should we do with this set? Which one is this set? It's just really handy, so I recommend using it. The seamless is are laid horizontals to avoid risk. Let's keep it that way. And if they're pushed up against the wall, it shouldn't affect those higher seamless because they curve the lights are it's film tape my favorite collage that i've ever done in my life knock knock haha -ha. it's from that movie where sean mendes played the crocodile i'm gonna make a ducky out of him ha -ha. he's a pikmin today that bust is actually good for sewing once again okay this is off the record but my broke my sewing machine and it was a whole big deal and like i'm like i'm like dude and then that was fine that he broke it but then like uh, the way he handled him breaking it was Okay, I don't, I will, and then he was trying to gaslight me, and I was like, bro, you're choosing the wrong person to try to gaslight. I'm like, girl, you can't do this right now. And I'm like, girl, I have, like, way bigger fish to fry than being gaslit by an old white man today. He's also, like, nice. Okay, fuck it. Whatever. C-section. I keep calling them C-sections, bro. C-stands. Largely film section. I encourage you to paint with this setup, draw with this setup. I like having this little side table here. I just left this piece for you. A little more. Don't doubt your desire to create. Ba -ba 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 bars, 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 bitch, bars. These are all oil paints, the ones that are hung up. I couldn't figure this out yet. And once again, feel free to move it around as you see fit. But my idea was that probably when you're working here, you can use this cart to be like, what do I want today? Hmm, pick this, pick this, pick this, and then you go back and do it. That's what I was thinking. But do whatever you want with this. I just like, blah. Give it a whirl, try something new. Balloon animals, that could be neat. Over here, I have a library section. I think it's very sweet. Little libraries. My friend Lena gave me this as a gift. It's self-love. One of those like, we're not really stranger cards, but it's for your self-love edition. It's a wonderful journal prompt, art prompt. But yeah, a big array of, array of books here. And you can be like, hello, little booty, hi. Up here, I have some zines. And this is, uh, this is like a small, X. this is called the X-Fold zine. And uh, this sheet of paper is what I used to, what I, how I learned about it. It was at a workshop. But it'll give you the step-by-step -step instructions on how to get this kind of fold. And it's really a fun activity. This is more reading material, books that are too large that didn't fit. And a little music station. Are you fucking kidding me, girl? Wait, what's that? Oh, it's my finger. <sighs> Have some fun. I find this to be a big stress reliever. The leak is mostly in that corner, but everything else is usually fine. Dude, I think that's it. Bro, that's crazy that that's it. Oh my god. Girl, my flight's in like literally 10 hours. This video to show you the cozy vibes of when, the, when those lights on. <laughs> It's so cozy. It's so cozy. So very cozy. Whoops, other way, other way, other way. Other way. Cozy. Cozy. Okay. Bye. Have fun. Make a lot of art. Wee! Bye.
Bye, Ale. I love you forever. What the heck? I didn't think that part would make me sad. I'm gonna be back. It's been a long time since I've seen your name online. A I M is a word.